going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully you guys at home are having a fantastic day. Before we jump into today's video, guys, a huge shout out to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. BetterHelp will assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist. You can start communicating within just 48 hours. It's not a crisis line and it's not self-help. It is professional therapy done securely online. There is a broad range of expertise within BetterHelp's 20,000 plus network of therapists. The service is available for clients worldwide. You can log into your account anytime and directly message your therapist. You'll get timely and thoughtful responses, plus you can schedule phone or video sessions weekly. So you won't ever have to sit in those uncomfortable waiting rooms with traditional therapy. BetterHelp is committed to facilitating great therapeutic matches. So they make it easy and free to change therapists if needed. It's even more affordable than traditional offline therapy and financial aid is available. BetterHelp wants you to live a happier life starting today. Visit betterhelp.com slash fair. That is better H E lp.com slash flair and join the over 1 million people taking charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional. So like I said, click the link down below. You'll actually get 10% off your first month if you go to betterhelp.com slash flair. That's better H-E-L-P.com slash flair. Link down below, get 10% off your first month if you guys want to check it out. Huge shout out to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. It's brands like them that I partner up with that allow me to do what I do every single day, which makes videos for you guys at home too enjoy. So with that being said, enjoy the rest of today's video. Shoo! What is going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another video. We are starting the day off. We are at Banjo's favorite store on planet Earth. Yeah, they sell chocolate milk here, you know that? But he's a huge chocolate milk guy. Well, we're going to Menards. We are going to go in there. Today's adventure is going to be making the homemade deer blind that we made out of scrap wood into the ultimate man cave. We're talking TVs, PlayStations, Xbox, cooktops, insulated with heaters and recliners and all, I guess I don't know if we could fit recliner. Maybe one recliner in there. I'm not for the lazy boy hunting challenge, personally. <laughs> but we are gonna go in here and just get all sorts of goods. And then we gotta go to Walmart as well. Definitely get that cart. We're gonna try to get a bunch of stuff to basically make the ultimate man cave. To where like this thing is like super sick. I guess you could put a light in there. What if you just did like a, like, it looks like, like a light home? switch. You could yeah. stick it to the, the roof, then you could just like flick it on. Anyways, yeah. we're gonna get a bunch of different stuff today. Some decoration. Tis the season, so we gotta get some Christmas lights in there. Speaking of lights, we gotta be in the vicinity here. I know exactly what I'm I know thinking. What you're about. The light it looks like a light switch, but I yeah. think you can like command stick it to the ceiling or around it. Here we go. For some reason, I like the little light switch one. I know they have. They got to. Or we just have to get these ones, but I like the light switch ones. Because you can like stick it right by the door and you literally use those light switch and then boom, you got your light. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I swear they have them here. Walmart probably will have them too. But I mean, we could always get these just in case. You can get the one with the remote and turn on party mode. What I mean, mean, it's not as cool, but. Is that battery? Oh, Candy good board. I don't think it is. I'll say that's a, I don't know what kind of battery you got. Car battery? You might just have to rock these guys. But you got a little remote. You can turn on party mode where you got like disco lights. Dude, I mean, we're talking man cave. What's going on there? Oh, oh it's I a thought, plug in. I thought that. Okay, I don't see what we're looking for. Nah. But so, I mean, this one's just sticky or magnetic. What is it? What's the back? on this it's got 55 lumens things remote control. i mean i like the idea of remote control i feel like that's yeah. that's nice do we need to get like sticky easy installation with screws or tape included okay well we get screws or tape we're, we're good to go so we got lights boom with remote good to go on the light next up what are you thinking uh christmas, i think christmas decorations are right over here yeah let's get some decorations Four. see i knew these suckers would have it try me excuse me I've been, been tried too much. I mean, the remote's not See, old. Uh, Look. See, should we get those? Oh, two? yeah. It comes with four of them, too. Okay, okay. We'll get them. This thing's going to be lighted uh, like crazy. I guess we're going to put this back. Um, nah, nah, nah. We'll get it. Just, right. We'll put those on the ceiling uh, and we'll put the light switches around the right. corner so then you can just pick which one you want to light, light up yeah. with. Okay. See, I knew they would have that. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, anyways. Now nah, back to where I reared it. Oh God, yeah, here we go. The old spiral tree in the corner. I guess how many batteries are you gonna run in this sucker? Better, we better get a solar panel for all this stuff. What are you thinking for decorations? You like that? Is that, fa is that festive? I feel yeah. like that. That guy's kind of chill. I kind of yeah, okay. like him. I mean, we definitely need to hang some lights on the inside. We're the lights section. Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. Look at all these trees. Man, we should have built a bigger blind. We could have had a full blown tree in there. Okay, what do we got lights wise? Not exactly. Those are for bushes, I think. Oh, uh, here's the lights. Here we go. What are you thinking here? Do you like these guys? 
is a professional wow, decorator it's... series. Really? Yeah. I... They give you all the options on the other side. Did you see that? Oh. Oh, like all this? Yeah. Oh, yeah. sheesh. I mean, those are kind of cool. Oh, you want? Oh, let's do the big bulbs. I, I agree. Like... Okay. Where's the big bulb strap? Right there. Oh God, yeah. Okay. Boom. Big bulb Christmas lights. I like it. We're gonna need to get a inverter or probably a car battery. Some what? You find some more too? Oh, yeah. sheesh. They got a wow. whole section for lights. Ooh, extension cords. Probably gonna need. So let me think about this. We can get a brown one, then it'll match. Boom. Okay. Bingo. And maybe maybe two of them. What are you thinking? Next season we buy a treehouse and we hunt. Bro. Real talk though, that's a great idea. <laughs> great idea. Dude, Put in the notes folder. Yeah, dude, that would actually be sick. Building like a tree house that you buy at the store. Two grand though? Sheesh! I mean, maybe we can make it. Yeah, we maybe yeah. need we need to build one ourselves. We need to. So is there different ones or are these? I, I mean I you tell me. I feel like those would be fine. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna get a I'm just gonna get a splitter that'll give us some more more juice. That'll give us enough juice. Kobe. So. Yes, here's the stockings. Do they have number numbers? What? Number one in D D one. I'm confused. Is that lowercase L? What is that? Yeah, I think yeah. so. No one, no one likes the you L. D for daddy or what? D for daddy, it is, my guy. Are we just gonna make up names at this point just to get? <laughs> is that L or I? Yeah. I don't know. I, my, don't, I don't know. My middle name starts with a T. Okay, T. that's you, yeah. big Timothy guy. What's your middle name? David. D. Is it oh, in there a D? Yeah, you got Wait, the D. Oh, here. There you go. Here, right. oh, here, D. Thomas. What else we got? Which one do you want? Not a lot of options. I wish there was beef for beefcake. Uh, that's the yeah, only other thing I could really think of here. Really? What's that good for? It's a hat. Really? Yeah. You just got to pick one here. P. Okay, P it is. You guys will comment down below what P stands for. But you got D for David. You got T for Timothy and P for you guys have comment down below. All right, decorations. Check. I think that's all we need for decorations. You good? You want a candy cane? <laughs> we need a wreath. Hang on. We need a oh, wreath yeah. for sure for the door. 100%. This is a necklace. What's... I think you'd rock that. Really? All right, let's go find a wreath. 34. Are you out of your godforsaken <laughs> mind? It's $9. What is this made out of? Gold? Two cents for a wreath. Four, who spends four? My wife would probably spend $40. But who would spend $40 on a wreath, bro? Like, yeah. are you out of your mind? Get a hanger. God, what do you think I am? This is crazy. All right, so I guess we're going to, because we're going to put on the back door. I guess, I mean, we're going to do it. I guess we got to do it right. But man, why are these so expensive? Like, this one looks badass. $40. Yeah. Excuse me? One dog. What? <laughs> what does that have to do with wreath? I don't know. It's just, it's just, it's just the toy, is what you're telling me. Oh, Oh my gosh, they're getting, they get even more expensive. $65 for a wreath. We need to get in the wreath making business. You literally just hack down some branches, make it go in a circle and charge it. Ass load. This is just nuts. I mean, I want one that looks cool, but guys, nips. Bruh. Okay. What are you thinking here? Or should we make a run at this point? Because I feel like we might need to hold it. 70? And are those real cherries? Can I eat those suckers? What are those things? I like, I'm a big mini guy. Really? Yeah. That's it. <laughs> Little guy. On the hanger? That's hilarious. Does that does that make sense? That's solid. Yeah. Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I just I can't just I spend budget. forty dollars on a wreath. Like it just it just doesn't make any sense to me. Staple gun gun or staple thing should be over here somewhere. All right, Steve. I want the one you whack. Uncle, yes, Uncle Beefcake has them. These things are the best, bro. Just, bah, bah, bah. I love these things. So T50, so this guy's solid. And then T50 staples. So right here. Yeah. I mean, 5 16 is probably fine. I, don't, I mean, I don't think you need to go I think it's super oh, deep. Top. Are these all hammer dudes? So here you go, here you go. Okay, Wait, three eighths. Let's get, let's get some three eighths and some 5 16 Perfect. Hey, let's get some halves too while we're at it. Perfect. Yeah. Lots of staples. Okay. I do have a couple staple guns if we, if we want to buy. I probably have, I probably have some. Just so we can. Yeah. You know, yeah. multitask, du dual team it or something like that. But okay, we good? We got staples. Check. All right, it is now time for some carpet. We need a big old shaggy seven by eight. I want something that's quiet as quiet. Really? The shaggiest is going to be the quietest, right? It's going to get dirty, but you know, it's all right. Like this brown cocoa, rich cocoa. I kind of like the brown vibe. Yeah. Brown's, brown's a good vibe there. Okay, so we need to find somebody that can, or do they have a pre-made rug that's not super expensive? Here's six by eight, but it's not super, it's actually softer than, what is that? Oh no, it looks expensive. Does that say anything? No, I like that though, but I bet it, I mean, that's like a bougie rug i feel like that's gonna be expensive no maybe not that's only like five by something though yeah, probably true. not quite oh here's some more here's some more okay what do we got clearance 289 oh my god okay i don't think rugs are the strap i think we need just a piece of junk carpet i feel like there's some more check these prices six by nine pre-cut vinyl oh that's vinyl we could lay some vinyl and make it look i don't even know what the orange is for but here's a six by nine area rug Ugh. i don't know i feel like we're gonna end up spending too much money on yeah, if we do rugs that was 50 dollars. 50 bucks i like the little spinny thing anyways let's make somebody cut some carpet Thank you very much. You bet. 
great stuff, Pro Series. Subfloor drywall and foam panels. What do you think about that? Gap filler. Big gaps? We got some gaps to fill. Is that what you want? Is it like, not that it has to be insulation, but you know what I'm saying? Like yeah. It needs to yeah. be insulating foam sealant. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, no, that's it right there. That's what we need right there. Well, there are some holes and some gaps that need to be filled inside the blind. So, we've got some great stuff. Big gap filler up to three inches. So, there you go. Now, we're looking for something. Instead of building it, I know I'm usually a build, build it guy, but we don't have a whole lot of scrap wood left because we use most of it from the cabin build. I want to find something that's like yay size, countertop, two cabinets that we can put a little miniature little flat top grill on. Instead of building, I think that's going to be a little easier. And then you can move it. I think that's somewhere over here. Almost like one of these little guys. Can I buy that? Can I just take that? That would fit your grill. Awk yeah. Awkwardly sideways, maybe. Or we'll get something a little wider. But something like that. Well, here, I'm going to pull off one. Of okay. Things. All right. Oh, that's so hilarious. That one yeah. looks. It's literally marble. Yeah. <laughs> But Banjo, I said quartz countertops. We got laminate, the, the the wannabe quartz countertop, but we had to get something that looked fancy. It's like, you know, we could have got a sweet butcher block, but I'm like, we had to get something fancy. These are unfinished as well because they were the cheapest. It was still, how much was it? A hundred, then hundred bucks for that. But we're going to be able to store our pots and pans, our cooking utensils, whatever type of gear we want. And then we got a four foot countertop with a three, or it's a 30, maybe it's a 36, 33 inch, I think is what it is. So we'll have a little bit of overhang. I think we're going to cheat it to one side. You'll see when we get in there, we, we might move it around, but countertops done. Everything else in there is done. The biggest thing that we're still looking for is pew hooks to hang up pews and coats and bibs and jackets and hats and all that, as well as insulation. We are fully insulating this sucker today. I know it's gonna look better if we like finished it, put like some beadboard or some shiplap on it, but I think the acoustics, meaning like the echo and sound will get absorbed better if it's just pure insulation on the inside. So I know it won't look as good, but we're gonna do that today and try it. For some reason, we're like, ah, this looks like absolute, you know, wiener. Then we might eventually someday, maybe not today, get some shiplap or, or some like plank wood or kind of finish the inside of it. But for now, I think we're just going to insulate it and that will hopefully dampen the sound so that way the deer don't hear us while we're playing, you know, Call of Duty and whatnot. So stay tuned. Shoo! All right, we got some insulation, $100 in insulation. We have decided since we just read, the guy's like, so how far did you put your studs apart? I'm like, you know, we just kind of just threw it together. We didn't really factor that in. So I know I just got done talking about how we are not going to finish the inside of it with like a shiplap, but we are because we don't have anywhere to tack our insulation to. Something super thin and cheap, not plywood. We can get one that's got like a little design on it too. That kind of looks cool. I know I've bought some stuff. I don't know what, I, always, I call it shiplap. It's probably not. There's beadboard, there's shiplap. I I want to say what I bought in the past was speedboard, but I'm not like it's it's close to this, but it's got a there's a texture to it, so it looks cool. So we have nothing to tack our insulation to. So I'm like, you know what? We're just gonna have to hold it up and, and put on big sheets of this stuff to basically sandwich our uh, insulation up there. What do you got there? Oh, bro, dude, I wish I wish they had one that looked like a, like a log cabin. Wouldn't that be That'd sick? Be we still hadn't I still hadn't seen what I'm thinking about, but if you try to make it look like farm, farmhouse, it already looks like a little chicken coop. Are we are we an aisle off right now? It's literally back there, but. They just didn't have, it's got like a little groove thing to it. Dude, camo. No. Dude, that's sick, I've never seen that. No. That's whole Dude, idea. you can make some cool stuff with all this. I still don't see what I'm thinking of. I swear, I'm not like crazy in the head. Oh, right here. So this is what I'm looking for, but it's bigger. Yeah. So it's these. See how thin and lightweight that is? What's it called? Wayne's coat. I mean, Wayne's coat's for the bottom. We're looking for this in bigger sheets, like eight foot sheets further down. Oh, dude, what if we made it look like a brick, brick house? Dude, I'm serious, should we do it? <laughs> Should we do it, bro? We have to. If we're gonna do it, we better we better make it look cool. Oh, oh, there's more. But wait, there's more. What else we got over here? Real cabin looking. Oh, see, that's, that's yeah, cool. I was thinking about that one too. It makes it look like a log cabin. Yeah. Okay, that's that's up there for me. Dude, I don't know. This this fits the vibe, Dude, I feel it like. Does. It really does. How much? Oh, it's only 37. That's not that's not that bad. Let's do it. Let's do eight of those guys then. I think that's gonna look the best. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, no Thank problem. You were saying hooks on the side, right? For the yeah. like spatulas and whatnot? Yeah. So these are magnetic. You mean like the pans? We just there. need the ones that are sticky. Self-adhesive L hooks. Those okay, we can stick those on the side. Bingo. Okay. Not for the pews. Pews, I've got like these before. They're not all, I mean, that's like excessively large, but I've got like that style and it it works. What are these? Like these would work. Oh, yeah, we've yeah. done those before. We've done those. They don't hold your pew like mint, but they do They do okay. I mean, are we gonna have a pew in there that doesn't have a strap? Do you just hang it? Like I a foot strap. I think that'd be easier, yeah, to be honest. Cause then you can use them for coats. You're thinking just a few of these guys then? Yeah. Those Perfect are better, size. that's excessive. Yeah. yeah, so you can just hang, hang your pews, hang your coats, hang your hats, all that sort of stuff. So bingo, that'll work. Shoo! 
all right well we got everything that we needed we loaded up spent nine hundred dollars that is literally more than the blind itself we built the blind out of scrap wood plywood and a pallet with the windows we made it out of plexiglass i think we were like 700 i think into it and then we spent nine hundred dollars on this making it fancy see we wanted to build it on a budget and then make it super fancy and we haven't gotten the tv or the playstation or any of the actual expensive stuff yet so we're gonna get this sucker loaded up we'll see you guys at walmart stay tuned Walmart, here we are, ladies. Well, there's also a, was that a GameStop? Oh, there's GameStop over there, too, if they don't have the right game. Hey, that look, that's ocean proof. She ain't going nowhere. All right, we're gonna go into Walmart. We gotta get a TV. I'm thinking, so a 36 by 36 is like the top bottom. I kind of went on a diagonal curve. Do you know how to calculate that? There's definitely a formula for that. You get your 45, what's your what's your 45 degree angle on a 36 by 36 square? It's too early for that. Someone's gotta know it. I think it was like 44, 40, I think a 40 inch TV would fit fine. You don't want to go like too crazy, but if we can find like a 40, maybe a 42, I think we'll be good. And then PlayStation or Xbox or whatever is probably the cheapest. Some Call of Duty going hunter, Call of the Wild or something like that. And we will be in business, so stay tuned. Shoo, all right. The hell, Rick? Okay, TVs. 43, 42, 40. Ooh, high sense. Sounds that, sounds cheap. What you have. Is that fourteen dollars? What's that? Mean? I think we had a high sense. It works fine. Forty incher. I feel like forty incher will do. They got Roku. Hell yeah. Two forty. High sense. Two one hundred forty bucks. I feel like that's not bad. That's pretty darn cheap. Oh no. Oh, when we're getting forty inch, forty three. Yeah. yeah. Oh yeah. So two hundred twenty four. I don't think you can beat that. Sign me up for that, my guy. That's what I'm talking about right there. The old high sense. What happened there? Oh god. Oh, who in that? You had one job. Oh, I think they do that. No. All right, here we go. What do we think? What, is, what, is, what do these suckers go for nowadays? I ain't bought. They not have consoles? Bro, what if they're just out? It was yeah. just Black Friday. Not too long ago here. Oh, no. What if we can't get them, bro? What are we going to do? I have a place in here, but it's at the ranch. So I'm just going to get a new one. We don't have to go all the way down to the ranch and back. They don't have consoles? Dude, you're telling me they don't have consoles here? Not not a single console we of have any to go to sort? Oh, yeah, the GameStop's up the road. We might have to. That's fine. We got the, t we got the TV. Yeah, let's ask somebody. That's some more shit. Walmart at zero and GameStops were close. So we end up getting an Xbox S, Xbox One S, whatever that is. Um, and we got Black Ops 3, only game they had. Kind of a struggle out here, but we're doing what we can. That was another grand. So now we're two grand in, I think. So the blind itself was like 600, 700, or two grand into making it. And then not including the grill we're gonna put in it, cause that's already bought. So we probably are, yeah, pushing 2250 into this sucker. It'd be, at the end of the day, it'll be a $3,000 blind, but it should be the nicest coat coziest, comfiest blind he ever darn did see. So we're gonna get this sucker loaded up and head back home. There's no chance we're getting this thing done today. Well, at least in the daylight. We might get it done. We'll just have to see how quickly we can work out. Sitting here thinking we gotta call in some reinforcements, but Sunday and everyone's got the day off except for Banjo and Chase. So we're just gonna have to see what BFK Construction can do with three-man army. You guys stay tuned. Shoo! Made it back into the BFK garage. Lucy, what you doing, puppy? What you doing? What you doing? What you doing? Well, Banjo, you hadn't seen the whips. I haven't seen Brand new whip, got new keys or no keys. How what's that sound go? Brand new whip, got no keys. How do you, how do you get no new whip without keys? That didn't make no sense. Then you you know what song I'm talking yeah, about? Sounds illegal. Yeah, I, brand new. Oh, is that what he's saying? He stole it. Yeah. He, wow. Okay. Well, Banjo's never seen these suckers, so we definitely got to get them fired up. We hadn't tuned them or nothing, so you're not. It's not gonna run away on you. Got turn Dude, they're they're road legal. You can 100 drive these on the road. Dude, they go like 50 miles an hour. They yes. shred. Yeah. Yeah. No, they shred. All right. Yeah. Go ahead and hop in. Take her for a spin. I thought you said these were manual, no? They are. They're a three speed. Oh. Uh, yeah, you'll see. You'll see. Okay, so choke, choke it. Give it a little bit. Keep going. Okay. See, this needs to be warmed up. Okay, so go reverse. You know, you have to be in neutral and then you kick it down. Yeah. Now you're back in neutral. Okay. Then you're in first. So you'll yeah. rev it until, you know, yeah. it's right. And it, yeah. first, it's not it's going like quick. A, yeah, it's like a dirt yeah, bike. Yeah, it's like a dirt bike. And then you okay. just then just take it and smack, smack it in a second. Up. And then you just downshift it. Don't be going fast and downshift. downshift. It'll, yeah. it'll rip. I mean, you know, but yeah. see what happens. I gotta get in the other one. We gotta we gotta play bumper cars real quick. Hey, we'll, we'll work on the blind. Don't worry. We just gotta have a little bit of fun for <laughs> it. Oh, coming in. Oh, rip. I gotta get her warmed up.
second ago. It takes a little practice. I don't know, I couldn't get her going. That's good. Right at the end, we got her fired up. All right, let's get to building that blind. Say it real quick, as if this thing's an easy thing to move. It's not perfectly on there. I got a little ways to go. You scoot up yeah, a little bit, and then fine. we're gonna go ahead and ratchet this sucker to the skid loader. We're gonna get it on the trailer, back the trailer into the shop, so we can work on it. So when it's done, we can just drive the trailer down the hill and get this sucker set up in the food clock. Okay, tilt it up a little. barely so i guess this trailer is eight foot wide then because it is right on the edge we didn't break nothing so that's good it is solid as solid yet so i mean i don't think it's going anywhere but i am going to run some straps under the pallets basically you want it to pull it like down in that way and down in that way and then we'll back it into the shop and get to work it's like what 233 sun's going down all right we it's been all day we started filming at nine it took some time to get some material so i can promise you guys it's going to go into tomorrow lucy it's going to be a two-day adventure but anyways we'll get strapped down move it in the shop and we get to build stay tuned Shoo! All right, well, we're gonna start insimilating. We got more studs over here than I thought. I knew, this is what I knew we were. Yeah. Yeah, struggling here this is pretty big. but this is pretty decent yeah. size yeah i mean we have more to tack to than i kind of yeah. thought so we're gonna start on the back wall because that's gonna be easiest and then we'll probably do the sides and then we'll do the front last so we got some insimilation and a little hammer we're gonna try now that i now that i think we have enough to tack to i bet we can get it pretty close oh yeah, yeah, well, oh, yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, she's gonna be insulated. I can tell you that. Yeah. One. I'm gonna try my new toy here. Give it a rip. Bang! Oh, I missed. Bang! You don't even need it. I don't think. <laughs> yeah. I had it. I bought it. I gotta try it. Oh, see it working. Good enough. Oh yeah. I mean. It's it getting insulated. It's not pretty. I know ideally you put it on a, a heavy, not a heavy, but like a hard surface and you put a board next to it and you can cut. I've done it the right way. It's just, this is faster. This is faster. Sheesh, she said insulating's hard. Look at this. That's going straight in my esophagus right now. Oh, is that not good to breathe in? I don't think it's supposed to. I don't think Fiberglass is healthy. Build your immune system. I tell you, be a heater in this sucker, you're going to be in a t shirt. This is a t shirt. Perfect. That looks about, how do we get, I feel like we're getting really yeah. lucky right now. Yeah. That's the only one we're gonna have to rip. Oh, yeah, it'll probably just stay what's in there. Yeah. Where's my hand? Nothing to hammer can't fix. Yeah, that don't work. I don't want it to be pushing the siding, because that siding's kind of flimsy. You know what I mean? I don't want it to yeah. bulge it. We'd have to put another piece of wood, or just quit being lazy. Let's give her a slice. Probably not to use that piece somewhere else. Yeah. Look at us. All right, back wall's complete. <laughs> Dude, I'm definitely gonna die tonight. We're only gonna finish this side wall. Stay tuned.
I mean, sheesh. Ooh, I would say we did decent. Sheesh, buddy. This is looking, looking good. Looking fancy. It's a sucker look. Oh, yeah. Oh, sheesh. I mean, I'd say that's pretty darn good to me. But I don't have proper framing. I feel like that looks pretty decent. Yeah. Buddy. For not having proper studs to the tattoo, I'd say it looks pretty darn good. <laughs> ah, dang. Moment of truth. Woo. Oh, we messed up. Good news, it should fit on the other side, but we did mess up. Yeah. Bad. <laughs> Bad. We dumb. We just go, it, we're gonna, it's gonna have to work. We don't have a choice. She did it my way. We, we cut it a little short. Okay, so the next one, we gotta make sure we don't do it like that. Wow. We almost done goof. It's Big because idiot. I just measured it backwards. I mean, I didn't I didn't account for that. Yeah, but we still gotta cut out that notch right here. So. See if you done did it right, boy. There we go. Oh, oh holy yeah. smokes. Did we do it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you guys. Sheesh. I mean, yeah, it's about looking right. I had to cut it, unfortunately, on the nice side, so we got a little roughage, but it's all right. You guys, I would say you guys hit, did pretty good on that. Yeah. That's tight. <laughs> that is tight, my guy. And our slopes looking slopish. Sheesh. Sheesh. I got a little wonky right there, but not much you can do about that. Too many measurements. My head hurts. How's that look over there? Good. Fine. Our gap's not too Why are we, why are we, uh, here we go. That's fine. I ain't even worried about it. Good to go. All right, three walls. Look at these. Looking pretty. Pretty snazzy. I'll take it. This one, you think it's not gonna be the toughest one? Well, we're gonna have to get the plunge cutter and just cut these off. We have to start plunging. Really? Let's go! You're so excited! Oh, you're so excited! Woo! Nice cut, baby! Alright, let's see what we got. We're good there. Good there. Good there. Yeah, barely. Now hit it. I crooked it. Let's switch it. <laughs> wow, what'd you do there? Yeah, I know. Oh. <laughs> oh. Memory. That, yeah, that's a memory. Well, boys. Yeah, uh, you know. You got the bow window to cut out. Nah, you know. Oh yeah, there you go. <laughs> you know, big gap filler. You know, hey, we got we got gap filler for. Yeah. Uh, we'd be having the gaps. Mm. It's one of those things. You do something in just a few hours with a couple guys, you're bound to have something like that happen. I'll take it at this point. I mean, I still say it looks pretty good. I mean, it looks better and it's insulated. I guess we'll finish the rest tomorrow. So you guys stay tuned. Shoo! All right, good morning. Day two. We already did a little bit of work this morning, stuff I didn't really want to bore you with, but we got the windows in, and I took like four seconds last night to think, man, we got to come up with a better latch system. Our latch system was too loud. So here you have it, the old beefcake, twisty, knobby, piece of block wood, 3,000. Oh, rip. That's not super quiet, but that'll work. So we got them reattached and we realized all that cutting, no reason, because we just ended up going with that. We we ditched the, yeah, I can't remember what you call it, the bolt that slides down. We ditched that idea. So we really just wasted our time. We had no need to cut any of this stuff out. We could have left it, put that cedar block on the outside and it would have looked freaking way better than it does right now. But you know what? There's always next time. Probably not. Thank you guys are trying to figure out a quiet, quiet way to open windows. Oh, oh, okay. Well, you can't do, you guys get what I'm saying. Just some blocks right there. Make sure you take a drill bit and pile it Otherwise, you will split that wood, I promise. But we got those in, we got the windows in. Again, stuff that you guys don't really care about. We got this little latch back in here, and now it is all cleaned up and ready to go and ready for carpet. Lucy! What you doing, Lucy? Hey, I'm getting down. It's okay. You don't need to jump up here. All right, Lucy, hey. No, you don't need to get up there. Come on, Lucy, let's go over here. What's going on with this carpet? How, what do you think about we the carpet? chalk line it or what? Really? <laughs> they like it. Yeah, you're gonna hang out. I'm telling you, taking my dog. You think the deer could, the deer could definitely smell the dog, yeah. right? They think it's a coyote. Oh, what if Lucy alerted? Can you do that? What if Lucy said, 
And we're like, there's a deer. No, I probably can't do that. What do you think, buddy? Yep. Oh, okay, don't. Okay, all right. What? Yeah, what is the easiest? I mean, I've ran a tape measure and just like run the knife along the tape measure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, and yeah. and you want to cut it, I think, on the other side. I'll just dull the hell out of my knife cutting on this concrete. That's fine. Yeah, I think, I think, I'm pretty positive. Are you a carpet cutter? No, I'm not a carpet cutter. Do you from the top? Yeah, but... I thought it'd be easier to cut it from the bottom, yeah, no? Yeah, you probably cut it either way. I don't think it matters. But. How close is that straight line from our measurement? I was just, I was just like, yeah, I'm randomly throwing Here, that out there. Where's your tape? Just curious how, how close do you think 90? that is. What do we say, 90? Uh, what? Whoa! Easy there, buddy. What do we say? What, do we, what are our measurements? You said 89 and we were going to bump it out. Is that yeah. what it was? Lucy, come here. 91. Come here. Oh, oh, rip. Rip. Are we short? That line. No, 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 we're no. We're past no. that line. We're going to go to 91. Oh, we're, oh, we're yeah. close. Yeah. Just so we, no, yeah. I'm giving us like two inches. Hey. So the carpet hey. kind of like okay. against the wall. And then, and then this is fine? Yeah. Because we can cut it by no, seven or no? We need to cut that again. Cut yeah. how much? Uh, yeah. Like four inches off or something. Okay. So do you want me to do both? Yeah. Lucy, yeah. why are you attacking everybody? Why don't you just go lay down and do something productive? Okay, so I could probably get it. You think I can get away cutting on that line or no? You only gave me two inches that way? Yeah, I mean, what was that line at? Could I cut on the outside of that line? It was like within an inch of this measurement. What did you want it to be? 89 is like the original measurement, but I'm just giving us like a couple inches. So, yeah, so, so like your 90 carpet. should be I was going to say, I cut on the outside of that 90. Yeah, cut on the outside of your 90. Okay, let's get to cutting. Oh, yeah, brand new knife. Who this? Cuts like butter. Luke's saying he'd already be done. I mean, I would say yeah. that worked pretty darn good. Pretty, pretty good. All right. Now, are we cutting this way now? I got off a little bit. <laughs> That's not straight, I promise you that. <laughs> this was like $100 some carpet. Yeah. We got the shaggy stuff. Lucy, get out of the shop. What are you doing? What's the strategy? Knock everything down. Exactly. Go in. We didn't cut it too short. It's all it matters. All right, let's grab that knife and I'll get to cutting. You'll just walk around on the side. Take your shoes off. <laughs> yeah, don't get it dirty, damn it. Dude, how comfy is this? What? It's nice. Take your shoes off and feel oh, it. Oh, this is great. Sick. Oh, yeah. yeah. This is what I'm going to be doing while we're deer hunting. Yeah, yeah, me too. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> this is comfy. Uh, I can always staple it and then cut, cut it, it after yeah. so it's like in place That's and it's weird. not moving around on us. Watch your toes. What's up, man? <laughs> just so, just like hand your big toe into the carpet, and you're like, son of a. <laughs> oh, that one went right through my hand. God, oh. son of a. Them suckers are sharp. Let's cut the excess now. What's next, man? Do you get the vanity in here? Yeah. I keep on a vanity. It's not a vanity. Vanity's for just your bathroom. A cabinet. It looks like a vanity. Just tonight. a cabinet. Let's get that in here next. Marble and cabinet. Then, then we gotta get the TV. We found out also we got absolutely bamboozled at these suckers at Walmart. They were smarter than you would think. He sold me, he's such a con artist. He sold me an Xbox that doesn't like have an insert for discs. And then he's like, you want any games? And then sold me Black Ops 3 disc version for $44. My question is how many people do you think are laughing at you in the comments? Because they already knew. Hey, Flair, you're a dumbass. That sucker don't even read them discs. Why'd you spend all that money? So we gotta download some so better games. We gotta go least. find some good Wi-Fi and d download some games. And we'll, we'll still be in business today. And we got hang Christmas lights, stockings, wreaths. We bought a bunch of other stuff as well. We should be, we should be in business. Why he's cut carpet before? He's you you big carpet good. cutter? Look at Whoa. you. Sheesh, buddy. Beefcake carpentry. Wait, that's not carpet. That's no. wood. <laughs> why, why? Think about that. Why do they call? Why do they call a carpet installer not a carpenter? But they call somebody who builds out a wood a carpenter. Oh, you know what I'm saying? What, what do you, what you call somebody who installs carpet? Big carpet guy. Carpet installer. Carpet installer. I, used to I thought of I thought of an, I thought of the next T-shirt. You want to hear it? Camel towing. Oh. LLC. It's a tow service by Ralph. Camel towing. Hey, put that shit on a T-shirt. All right. Well, we're gonna cut this up and let's get the van on the inside and get it glued down. <laughs> Oh, baby. Like oh. I'll go find some adhesive. Yo, have you seen that thing on the internet where there's like a, you can cut the tip of it with the gun? Yeah. No. Have you seen it? Yeah. No. no. You know about? How? Uh, do it, do it. Shut up. Where has that been my whole life? No, you're lying. Yeah. You're lying. Yeah. You gotta like take this out of here. It was a t yeah. It was a tight. It was a tight fit. Yeah. And then you can cut the tip in that yeah. little hole. Apparently, I've seen that, I've seen that I, all over that the before. internet. Really? You've done it. Oh, see, I, I was like, you. I've never keeping this a secret. Well, Look, you see this? Yeah. It, it literally says spout cutter. Did you? Wow. I'm over here with a pocket knife. Like, oh, there goes my fingertip. Yeah. You're like cutting your hand off. Oh, bro. Right. I was today eight years old. <laughs> Are you kidding me?
You're a kid. I was today <laughs> years old. Oh, okay. Was that a TikTok thing? I, I, don't know. I learned more on TikTok than I did in four probably, years of college I didn't actually TikTok. attend. All right. We're good to go. I know you're supposed to like screw this down too, but anything that a screw can do, a tube of cock can do. So. Oh God, this countertop's large. You, always, always you can cut, cut it. it. I mean, you can shoot out of it. It's just not ideal. I mean, I can, so I can shoot right over it. Yeah. I really can. All right, let's see what we're cooking with here. We got nine inches. And bruh, the old eyeball strap. Already centered. That does it every time. Rip. Oh, oh, now we did it. I squeeze this thing with some Gorilla Grip strength. God, <laughs> dude, I'm squeezing this thing so hard right now. All right, gently set her down. It's sealed. Luke, you wanna get that propane bottle? Just shatters it. I mean, we got some drawers. That's we got some space now. Place. That's where we put all the snacks. Big all snack drink. Yeah, mini fridge right here. That's all I'm thinking right here. Okay, are we gonna handle the TV? I think that's the next big thing. I figure out how, here's our problem. Not a single stud right there. So, I'm thinking, there's a stud right here. Tack a two by four across. And then there's two by four right here and yeah, big toenail guy. We gotta do another one for the shelf. And we'll have to do another one for the shelf. We'll do the TV first. Yeah, yeah. So these go on the end of the TV. On the TV, yeah. You want you pull these down, so you're gonna want them like that. Alright, TV. Let's see what we got. Wow, those are 69. Dude, they give you enough. Is it oh this is just to fit your TV? Yeah. Got it. I'm guessing big MC guy. That's my guess. Bracket so on. Or you can put it, put it in. We'll just see where that lines up. Eyeball it. Maybe go a little higher. Okay. Just so this can open yeah, freely. Yeah, right. well, I think that's perfect for where your board, the high spot on your board. Oh yeah. That's perfect. I think it's too high, but I'll hold it. And I'm put it up. Let's see if it let's see what happens here. Keep going. I'm up all the way. Yeah. No, it, dude, you're like an inch off. You want to get fancy with oh, it. Just, just out. cut a notch out. Yeah. yeah. Cut a notch out. Okay. Just go down like it. Yep. Just like cut out like that. Yeah. I would cut it, to be safe, I would cut it in half and then over. Okay. And the width of a two by. You got that, saw guy? Ooh. All right. Let's see if that fits. Money. Yep. That's it. Oh, it's so close. We're gonna have to notch that. Okay, we put it as low as we could. Yeah, we're gonna have to probably notch that. Oh, watch the TV. Sheesh. This thing's stupid. Why don't we just have a sawzall? That's way faster. Are you hitting the tops? There. There. We're in, baby. On it. There. In there, like somewhere. All right. TV's in, and then we got this. We're gonna put a shelf there to hold the yeah. Xbox. She TV installed. All right, now we probably need to get the electrical ready, make sure it works, staple it. Yeah. And then run it down in this corner to keep your car battery in that corner. All right, let's get the power. Here's how we're powering the sucker. Now, we can make this solar if we want. Throw a solar panel on the roof, trickle charge the battery, or you just bring a charged battery with you. It, I mean, your TV ain't gonna take that much. Take that much juice anyhow. I hope the cheese and rice every time. All right, now that's there. Woo, okay, all right. Well, we got 12.7 volts, that sounds right, I guess. I don't know. So then this is hooked up to the TV. Plug that in. Oh, there's lights. Oh, we got it, look at that. Sheesh. Every, some reason I just get amazed every time this actually works, because it's like such a simple way to do it. It's like a $50 inverter, and boom, you all of a sudden got TV in the deer blind. Dude, like, this is crazy, dude. In the old deer blind. Dude, this is just blowing my mind right now. Go we gotta get a little mobile hotspot, plug that in the yeah. inverter, and then just rip. Imagine playing COD with like the, the uncut outdoors homies and just be like Ooh. ripping in here. Hey. What do you think about that? Why do I feel like this looks goofy? Can you just be like different? Whoa. Yeah, you that's what I was just thinking. Can, I was you, like, can you just be yeah, weird I like, like that, that a lot better? I mean, well, I, I feel like it, it's gonna hide your two by four better, or two by six, I should say. The only thing, I mean, you're just relying on your screws to hold it versus, <laughs> but you're not putting anything heavy. Hey, they said 35 pounds. This That's is factor fine. cap. All right, let's do it. 
Hey, right, how's it going? I think we're just going two screws. Throw it up there. Oh, yeah. And then you can run your cords. cords behind it. You can run your cords behind it. Oh, yeah. oh, sheesh. What are you talking about there, buddy? That's all you need to do. It's fucking <laughs> mint now. Oh! Bro, this is great! Bro, this is great. This is like a movie theater. Dude, this is so sick. Gosh, yeah. That's it. The chef sits there and the gamer sits here. Oh gosh, yeah, you might break your neck. Well, Banjo's gonna get the Xbox hooked up. So let's get this place decorated. Oh yeah. Oh dude, that looks good. I like those. Hey, it's a party. Dude, we turn it on. <laughs> Boom. Pew rack. Oh, look at, oh wow, dude. Oh, how did we get lucky? Well, perfect. It how? Perfect. How did that happen? We literally Crazy. have 360 Christmas lights in here now. She. Want to tell the people with the uh, DP and TV? Well, we talked about it. I mean, it's David for your middle name, T for T Timothy for Banjo's name, and P for Pookie Pookie. <laughs> well, yeah, that's his nickname. Oh, there you go. That's yeah, that's your nickname right there. Well, look, dude, the Christmas lights is cr like it's crazy in here. Oh, I now. love it. Christmas and so we're getting right now we're twenty nine percent downloaded. I had to get my little mobile hotspot in here. Oh, and then the wreath. We might as well just tack it to the inside. The door. Oh. Yeah, right here. Oh, that look good. Oh yeah. yeah. Rip. Might need Jake's. There oh, you yeah. go. Done. Merry Christmas. Merry Chrysler. Look at that. We got wreaths, we got lights, we got stockings. Propane. We got the goods. We got, we got propane <laughs> for the griddle. We'll have to get the griddle. Xbox is getting set up. This is, like, this is a deer one. That's what's this crazy. This is bougie. It feels, yeah, it's in, fully insulated. We'll have heaters in here. This is absolutely crazy. I love it. We have yet to accomplish the hard part, though. We, yeah. have, we have to move it. We can't hunt in the shop. Oh, you know what you can do after? It's like, That's after the hard deer part. season, you can make it an office. An True. outdoor office. This is just like off-grid office. Come in here. Here's your little desk. You can edit on or whatever but there you have it folks we're gonna let this xbox do xbox things get loaded up strap it down we got to get this sucker moved to the food pot we probably are gonna have to take down probably take down the xbox and the tv just to be safe oh just yeah. just to be safe I at least I put a gopro in here just to see what happens guys just me and jake, you guys me and jake in. stand in here and what just if see it like happens. falls off the trailer and you guys just die though right i yeah. think banjo well, just we built, we built this box i mean i got things to do i gotta go really all right well we're gonna strap down get moved down the plot set up ready to go and start playing some cod stay tuned Shoo! all right we got our strap down we got chain right there that's looped around holding it this way we got one strap here two straps here and then we got another chain right there that runs across the whole desk we got two that are holding it down like well pulling it this way and then pulling it that way and down and then these straps right here are holding it down so it doesn't get top heavy because otherwise it'll pretty much just have to rip right off these nails and this thing will be sent but we got roblox downloaded you've been yeah, ripping on the ripping on the roblox we got everything downloaded we got the mobile hotspot with us we can actually sh like get online and do that stuff. so we're going to take down the x anything that's going to completely just crash and fall probably take the tv down kind of dismantle everything we're going to take it down to the food plot which you guys know is right down the hill. that's where i've killed two deer i killed my first bow deer and the muzzle loader doe we're gonna try to take it down there take the skill loader down there hook it up and we're probably just gonna have to sit it down in the plot like because that's the only flat ground we have i don't think we're gonna be able to get it where that other blind used to be on that ridge i don't think it's gonna be possible so we're just gonna try to get it as far back in the food plot as possible and what i'll do is i'll set up a trail camera there we'll watch it over the next couple of days those does seem not to really care i think they're gonna be just fine they'll get used to it. we could brush it in i honestly don't think we need to i mean there it's gonna take them a couple days for them to realize hey this thing isn't gonna kill you and then we should be we should be good to go but literally look at that <laughs> You're literally playing Roblox. This is the reason why we have Roblox. Okay, well, you saw the game we have does not, or the Xbox we have doesn't play disc. So we've just been dealing with downloading. And the only thing we could get downloaded with, like this century was Roblox. Everything else was like, we tried like Hunter Call the Wild. We tried all sorts of other stuff. And everything was way too like big, like 100 gigs. And it, it would just take too long. But you locking, you locking Buddy in or what? <laughs> Will it not shut? It? Oh, there is a chain on it? No, it's good. Oh, okay. It was just super oh, loud. Oh, it was loud. <laughs> buddy's, buddy's jamming. Oh, yeah. All right, well, let's get everything taken down and put this sucker down on the food plots. We can get to hunt. Stay tuned. I think we're going. Great. The old bow kill action? Thank <laughs> you. 
It was my hitch. You're oh, fine. You're fine. fine. Shoo! We did it. That was nothing. That was this thing's a all. beast. Well, let's get her unstrapped and picked up with the skid loader and placed down in place, and then we're playing Roblox. So stay tuned. Hey, Andrew, you got B boxes right there that you're touching now. What do you think? A little, little bit of damage right there. Ah, that's Good better than I expected. Well, I think the angle's about right. I love we just put it right in the middle of the food flow. Like it's literally just like, there's like radishes under it right now. But it's the, that was about the flattest ground we could find. Yeah. We'll see what the deer thing. Dude, this thing is so sick, bro. Like the carpet, the countertops. We gotta put the TV back up there and the, the Xbox, but. Oh, dude, yes, money. You're Money. looking to your right, sees like the whole. Oh, dude, like there's not much of a blind spot anywhere. Like I don't think at all like even here i can lean enough forward and i can lean enough back i can see 360 well 180 i should say which is all we need nothing will come from behind us this is sick lucy what do you think buddy you gonna come on with us or what so they usually come look romilia she's just she's impersonating a deer right now unsuspecting doe or buff what bam get smoked right there that's easily oh yeah it's like 20 yard 20 yeah, 20, 20, 20, yep. 20 25 to that bend right there so easily doable with a bow or a pew or shotgun or rifle or muzzy or whatever but then if they come from for some reason they come over there they come from down there i mean this is legit but we got to get xbox back up and tv back up and we'll be in business boom we got power Woo! Uh, oh 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 roblox boom check i don't oh no I don't you have to have one. No. 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 Rip. No. No. We could bring the hotspot down here. I just didn't. Shoo, we got chairs. Oh, Not yeah. the old lazy boys, but they, they'll do. Oh, we're going to go grab the old hotspot. What a botch. Why can't you play games without Wi Fi nowadays? I used to rip on so many games without Wi Fi. Sma. All right. We got chair number one, chair number two, chair number three. So, number three, we can kind of go back in this little corner. And then, we'll up the shooters. The shooters are gonna shoot right here. You know what I'm saying? And then it's like, oh man, the, the deer aren't moving. And you come sit back here in the old papa seat. Grab yourself your controller. Flip this sucker around and wow, I just got <laughs> killed Millie. Bro, I could sit in here all day long. The first time we hunt out of this, we'll bring the cooker down. I've got a little flat top we'll bring down here. That's propane powered. We'll bring in the dishes, the utensils, all that. So we got pew hook right there. So it sits right here and you're like, Oh shoot, there's a deer right there. Kick down the window. You know what I'm saying? Just like that. Everything's looking good, dude. This is insulated. Bro, dude, I can, like, solid. That's what's crazy is it's insulated. It's waterproof. Like, I mean, it shouldn't blow away like our other blind that we had. We didn't build. We, we put together and it got yeeted. I, I would prefer not to be like in the food plot, but I don't think it's going to matter at this point. So we will literally have full blown Wi-Fi. We can watch we can YouTube watch videos. We can watch Netflix. Like, oh, okay. you could legitimately <laughs> just camp out in here. Life's behind. Boys only. Oh, hey. <laughs> All right, where's that sucker going here? I still can't get over the fact that Buddy sold me an Xbox that doesn't read this, and then was like, "Do you want a you want a game?" And then convinced me to go buy a game for fifty bucks. Really? Whoa. It's gonna be all right. All right, baby, we got her kicked up. Got the old hot spot going. Rob, what is Roblox? I don't even it's remember. like Minecraft, but it's worse. Like Minecraft on crack. I think. On crack? Really? I don't know. Powering imagination. Let's go, Buddy. Is he sniping or what? Join. I got no idea. What's going on this. here? Phantom Forces console. He, what, what is this? I've never. He looks like a Lego character. Is that what he's supposed to be? He, does he not look like one yeah, of the little Lego does. guys? Oh shoot! I have a gun. How do you play? I think you're low, 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 low. 
fun still. Yo, I could hang out here all day long and then it's like, oh shoot. <laughs> like this, oh, I'm kind of hungry. Chef up a little fried rice or something. Like you go off. Oh, Phantom, this, why is, no. this is Roblox? <laughs> it looks legit. This looks legit. What, yeah, what the hell? It's just like the COD we tried to buy, but then, well, it didn't, it doesn't read any disc. What's the point of selling discs? Why did you even sell it to us? He knew Why wasn't Buddy K, hey, by the way, just won't read the $50 game you have in your hand right now. Instead, he's just like, nah, screw this kid. Whoa. Oh my, oh, oh there we oh. go. She's going. She's getting it. Come on, how, what, how many items? Why you got 500 items? I need one gun. That's all I need. You ain't gotta give me nothing else. Oh, dear lord. This is gonna be a while. You guys, let us know what the next video you want us to do in this. Do you want us to do, I mean, besides hunting, 24 hour challenge. It'd be so easy. You could hours. easily do eating only what we hunt for 24 hours, meaning we, like, mm -hmm. dude, there's squirrels that rip here. Like, we could, like, try to call in some coyotes or whatever, oh. but, like, you could hang out in here, shoot a deer, cut the back strap off, throw it on the grill. We could do either eating only what we catch for 24 hours or just overnight challenge where we could sleep in here, do a little overnight. You could easily put like one cop that runs this way. Um, let us know what the next video you want to see. Video you want to see in here is. Oh, 94 items left. We're, we're doing good. Perfect. Well, we'll see you guys whenever this game loads. Oh god! Oh, 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 what kind of what kind of game? Oh, oh, it's like. Oh my god, this is like brutal, dude. This my, is like, my head, the side to side is super slow, but then like this is like insanely fast. A trick shot out here. It's like about to do a 360 no scope. Is, pixel it, is he on my team or what? Yeah, I think he's on your team. <laughs> All right, I said check. Dude, what is this game? I bet, dude, I bet there's some dudes that are just like absolute units, like win like 100k in tournaments playing this game. Oh, for crying out loud. Cr Bro, this is really hard to play. Whoever plays this, shout out to you, my guy. We have to get a kill today. Have to come on. All right, I'm gonna follow this guy. He looks like he's got scope. What the hell? What do you got? Sniper, dude. The, the the like it is so fast, but then so slow at the same time. Oh, oh no. Oh wow. How'd I not just die right there? Oh, oh let's go. Let's go. We got double that double kill. Oh. Double kill. Let's go. Let's freaking go. Oh, oh, there you go, folks. Billy and Lucy are having a good time. Again, let us know, comment down below what you guys want to see next here out in the, you know, main cave of Deerblind we built. And anything else we need to add? What did we forget? What did we miss? Comment in the comment section down below. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll catch you in peace.